All right. Let's continue. Thousand year door. I think I stocked up on items, so we're good. You smell that? It smells like a profitable situation. Yes, indeedy. Looks like my star is finally starting to shine. Not that it's any of your business. Wow. Well, oh, you weren't here before. Hey, 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 yo. I've got all the hottest new products right here. Look no further. Jam and jelly, ultra mushroom, dried mushroom, jump man. I don't have enough coins. Increase jump attack power by one, but lose your hammer ability. Pass. What, no more shopping? Sorry to hear that, my man. This is a limited at the time offer. I change the goods I offer from time to time, so come back real soon, right? Oh, you know where I should go before I do anything? The, uh, the vendor for the star bits. Because they had some badges that I wanted, so we'll go there first. It's just here, so there's not really much I need to do to get it. Yeah, you. Okay, so... After beating a foe, make hearts appear. Beating a foe, make more flowers appear. Make HP visible. Yeah, this, this, this one's gonna be useful. That one, I think, is probably going to be the most useful one, because then I can, based on the situation, swap, and they can still attack, because that's a problem right now. So how many badge points was it? Seven. I mean, here's the thing. I can sacrifice that. Don't want to sacrifice that. I keep that. So how many is that? I don't have enough. I'd have to sacrifice too much. Next level up, I'm going into badge points and then we'll use it. Yeah. But at least I have it. It'll come into use soon. Because there were a couple of situations where Coops couldn't do anything. So... We're going to prevent that. Oh, the contact lady. Um, <laughs> I haven't found her a replacement contact. It's set under the town. Let's not assume we have to go west yet. Hey, you're Mario. Wow, this is so cool. I never thought I'd meet a celebrity out here. Ooh, I know. Do you want to make an investment, Mario? My name's Lumpy, and I'm heading out to dry, dry desert to prospect for oil. I've lived my life hoping to get rich quick, and now my chance has come. But I still don't have enough startup funds. Could you please lend me some money? I'm accepting investments of a hundred coins or more. This is either legit or it's a scam. <laughs> and I don't know how to feel trusting someone in Rogueport, given what we've seen so far.
I'm just making time to drink my tea. Ah, fine. Thank you so much. You won't regret it. Why would you say that? No, I'm good. I'll be here for a while in case it's... But I just invested! What do you mean? Where's my return? I am asking for a return, like, three seconds after I invested. Typical investor. Pivot to something more profitable! I demand returns! Arrow must go up! Bar must be green! Forget about your dreams and aspirations. Make me return on my investment. Oh, uh, dear. <laughs> Shoot, yesterday I blew through 200 coins at the parlor. Can you believe that? But next time... Sounds like you have a problem. <laughs> Got some kind of problem? You think you can just barge into my hideout, buddy? You're probably just jealous. No one's snooping around. It's the perfect hideout spot. Can you what? See? Listen, this is a huge secret. But you look like an okay guy. I'm a wanted Goomba. I was a thief in another town up until about three months ago. Yeah, good one. But then, the heat came down, and I needed to hide out, so I came to Rogueport. Now that I told you I'm a lying low in this thief- wait. Now that I told you I'm lying low in this thieves' den, you gotta keep it a secret, okay? <laughs> I'm so slick. Why would you tell me that? Seems very counterproductive to what you're trying to achieve here. I'm gonna have to try and replace a contact lens. Um, I'm guessing it might be in the shop. Let's see. Do you have a contact lens? <laughs> yeah, what's that? You want a contact lens, you say? Mm, just wait a moment. <laughs> Gee, fella. I'm sorry, but we don't have any stock. Tough luck, I know. I can special order one right away for you, but it'll take a while. Okay, come back soon. But I need to get past her now, I think. Is this a thing where if I just walk outside and then come back, it'll be here? Oh. But you'll have to wait a little longer. Okay. Alright. Can I just, like, can I just say that I've ordered it? No, I'm not looking. I'm not letting you into the west part of town and you buy me a new lens. Sorry, end of story. I can't cook anything without my contact lenses in. Ah, my rage is so hot right now. I could cook you with it. All right. So this is a Mario game with... Canonically, it has um, a place where they hang people. <laughs> Jeez, dude. What is it with Paper Mario games being dark? Well, the only place I can think of to go under town is the sewers. Maybe there is more to do. Bad Brothers, the order. Oh, right. Okay. okay, okay. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I should probably mark it as red. Wait, where is that? Body, gear, badges. Eh, doesn't matter. That's fine. Wait, where is he? Yeah, there, fella. Welcome to the bazaar. 
but emits a starting meal with draw lists chat about points. <laughs> Customers receive one shop point for each item they purchase, up to 300 points. You with me so far? Oh. That's cool. What? Okay. Email. Notes, art gallery. Where is the email? Mailbox, there it is. Thank you for shopping at Toad Bros. I'm writing to let you know that the contact lens you ordered is now available to pick up at our shop. Assuming you can still see well enough to read this email, please stop it by your earliest convenience. But I did. Also, hold on, my headset's beeping. For those of you that don't know, I have a good headset, except for the part where it gets down to 10% battery and then it beeps every three seconds until I swap the battery out. When the headset could probably last another hour. Okay, there we go. It's here, I'm blind. Ironically, I was blind and didn't see the contact lens. Did you bring me my contact lens, Mr. Squishy? Oh, sweet relief. Thank you. Finally, the world is crisp and clear again. I can see. Oh, I'm so happy. Be careful from now on. People don't generally like having their stuff stomped on. Oh, it's uh, you again, uh, Mr. Stompalot. Well, my name is Zesty. I may not look like a chef, but I'm actually quite good. If you bring me my ingredients, or ingredients, my cooking skills burst to life and culinary magic happens. Want me to whip you something up? All right. Mushroom. Yes. Got a sec while I flex my culinary muscles. Doodle dee doo da. Sorry to keep you waiting. I'm not entirely sure you'll like this, but go on. Take it, Stompy. Want me to make something? If, she, if she's doing this for free, what's the downside? 6 HP, 2 FP. What's the downside? Like, why wouldn't I want to do this? Unless she has a chance of ruining it. I see no downside to this. That looks refreshing. So, yeah, I mean, no brainer, why not? Man, if I had a lemon wedge to put on my teeth, that'd be just like that. But you know, I'm... I mean... I fixed it. Why, sh why does she still look angry? Yeah, okay, so it's... Okay, actually, that is different. It's a different effect, but I like that effect more. Oh, 
Hey, Mrs. Ham. Why are you saying good morning? <laughs> That's confusing. Unless you're in another time zone. Uh, yeah, I'm good. Very passive aggressive, just I it was an accident, I I fixed it. I bought her a lens. Ah, how refreshing. This is my favorite place. It's the only peaceful area in all of Rogueport. Okay. Happy lucky lottery board. The bomb lottery rules. Jackpot, all numbers match. Second prize, three numbers match. Okay. Every day is a lucky day. Happy day lottery. New numbers every day. This lottery, fun and exploding with excitement. I'll tell you more. Okay. Happy Lucky Lottery is so special. You pick numbers, they might win each day. Just buy your lottery ticket here one at a time. Buy another if you change your mind. Then check on this board later if your number has come in. If your number matches the day's draw, you get a super happy lucky prize. The day's number is drawn each day at midnight. If you play, check the board every day. Well, that might happen today. And when I say midnight, I mean according to your clock at home. Okay. Here's your lottery ticket. <laughs> we'll check again at midnight. You can use the same number until you win the jackpot. Play lucky. Oh. So, uh, okay. I guess just check in. You know, the game's fun so far. I'm really enjoying it. I almost fell down that grave. Man, that was close. You know where that thing leads to all too well, and I don't want to go there. Ah. Puzzles. Okay, well, I'm on this side now. Locked. Say, I've never seen your face around these parts. Who are you? Ha, <laughs> I get it. You're a wanted man above ground and can't be seen in town, eh? Huh? No? Whoops. Sorry, sorry, sorry about that. Yo, Eddie the Mask here, sports fan extraordinaire. Know about stylish moves? Press A with perfect timing during an attack to pull off a stylish move. If you do it right, the crowd will just go wild. And some attacks have multiple ones. Each attack has different stylish moves, but I'll share one with you. After you've jumped on an enemy, try pressing A at the height of your rebound. Found hard? Well, it ain't easy. So you gotta practice, yo. Oh, did you come here to do research too? Excuse me, you're an adventurer? Really? Wow, that's the first time I have ever heard of anyone describe their occupation as adventurer. May temporarily make an enemy soft and drop the defense. Okay. I need more badge points. Yeah, I don't remember the Hercules game, so I'm not sure what you're referring to. Oh, visitor, eh? Hey man, this dude knows everything. He'll give you some seriously good advice. Of course you'll have to pay him for it, yeah? That's the way it goes. What is this thing? Howdy, my name's Wonky and I... I just know stuff. It may not look like much, but I have a thing or two. You better believe it. 
Okay, not a thing or two, sorry. And who knows? The stuff I know may even be the stuff that could help you. So if you want to ask me a question, just speak up and ask away. If you pay me five coins, I suppose I can tell you about what's behind the sign. Sure. There's a billboard in front of the shop in town with all kinds of stuff written on it. Well, some folks like to write graffiti on the back of the message board, you know? There's all kinds of good stuff there, especially for an info guy like Old Wonky. You should give it a gander next time. And that is that. If you need anything else, just ask Old Wonky. No. I'm good. That was not- that was not the five. Not worth the five. I know stuff too, seriously. Like, when the wind blows, the cradle will fall. I just don't know why it falls, cause no one tells me. <laughs> this is a special refuge for all, where we cultivate information. Herb T's place. Sit back and enjoy yourself. That wasn't great information. Hey, go read the bulletin board. If you read stuff, you might find out information. That'll be five dollars, please. Hi there, welcome to Deep Down Depot. What can I do for you? Good. What is this? A gold bar. Just as described. Okay. Don't have enough. What is this? Makes a party member recover HP gradually for a brief period. Yeah, okay. Oh, really? Well, that's fine. Is that garlic? I didn't notice garlic. Ah! Right. Good blocking. There we go. Oh, we got the roulette thing, but I thought green is bad. I feel like I don't, I don't know. I don't want to find out. <laughs> I associate that with uh, bad things. I can't head bop. Oh, no. We'll use saddle. We haven't identified this one. That's a spania. A spinia with spikes on its head. It looks meaner too. So sort of the same as a spinia. You ought to watch out for the spikes on its head, but otherwise, just wail on it. I gotta be honest though, the way that thing spins makes me want to yak.
Oh, that was not worth much XP. Oh. Okay, that's a problem. I was trying to hammer. It's okay. Can I see something? Press A with perfect timing. Okay. Get him. Yeah, worth the two. Two XP. Overkill, what overkill? It doesn't look like I can keep going in that direction. Alright, back up we go. Oh, I know where this is going. Yeah, that makes sense. No! Ah! Why is jump and enter pipe the same button? <laughs> Seriously. Wow, this town may be full of rogues and punks, but this part sure feels safe. Don Pianta does a good job of managing things. I feel totally safe shopping here. The boss told me to look after this place. You do anything funny, and I toss you like that. Hey, how you doing? What, me? I'm on top of the world, baby. What's that now? You want one of those member cards that increases the mini games you can play, do ya? Now let's see, maybe if you help someone in trouble, they'll give it to you. That is cool. This is the scoreboard, numbers, it's a big game boy. I love checking my scores on this machine after playing games. I'm here all day. What? My husband is worried about me? Oh, don't be silly. He doesn't mind. As long as he's riding, he doesn't notice what anyone else does. Psst. This place is run by the head of the Pianta Syndicate. You can play fun games in here and win Pianta tokens to redeem for prizes. Yeah, play to win and get those prizes. Okay, I need to help someone to get... Um prices, I guess. Hi there, cutie. Welcome to Westside Goods. I'm here to store. I think we got all, like... Yeah, that should do. Who looks like they're in trouble? <laughs> Yet another day dwindles away while I loaf in bed doing nothing. Oh well. I am rich after all. Must be nice.
My dad's writing a novel. But it'll never sell. It's terrible. Grr, my wife spends all day in the parlor, so I never get anywhere on my novel. I need to go off to places I've never seen to get some... Get inspired to write or something. Are we helping him? Let's, let's go back and talk to her. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. No, he does mind. Um, let's go to the counter, maybe. Welcome to the parlor. Hey, hey, hey. You're Mario, like the one and only. I know all about you. Rescuing Princess Peach is important work, but even heroes need relaxation. Okay. I don't have a card. didn't lead anywhere. find the pipe that connects with Boggly Woods. There's probably one underneath Rogueport, so it's in the sewers, I guess. Alright, I guess I got it into the sewers. That other spot. I've seen that chest multiple times. <laughs> I want to get to it. But I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna look into it. Because I know it's gonna be something simple. I'll be able to do it later easily. Okay, underneath the town. I guess let's have a look. Oops. Damn it. <laughs> Forgot. Fight them. She can't help. Hey, Dead Mimic, thanks for the Prime. Appreciate it a lot. There we go. Let's try that again. What? Oh, come on. <laughs> What happened there? There we go. Jeez. What's wrong with me? <laughs> the 
see, this just leads here. No, it has to be from the west end of town, because that's the only place you can go down again. I probably gave up too soon, though. We'll have a look at some of the other stuff, but I get the feeling it's on the west end. Oh no, but this is the battle power thing. No, 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 leave it. I don't know what that, that goes. It's not the way. ever seen one of the cre little creatures from Boggly Woods? I hear they visit this town sometime. So it says down, but then it says... visits the town every now and then. <laughs> whoa, whoa, hold up now. You're an outsider. Past this point is the turf of Ishnail, head of the Robos, plus 10 to pass. I can take you. What? You gotta be kidding. You think you can fight your way through here? I'm gonna make you eat up your words, tough guy. Let's get this party started. Am I gonna regret this? Is this a joke fight? Let's see. Gus, he's super annoying and tries to take tolls from everyone. He's pretty tough. Oh, and I'm sure this is super obvious, but that point of spear of his hurts if you jump on it. I wonder if this guy watches people pass 365 days a year. Talk about a workaholic. I need to swap her out because she, uh... Her jump's not gonna help. I thought it was going to be a jerk fight where, like, one stab would take me out. The effect of the charm doubled your star points. Oh! Okay, that- oh, that- awesome.
I've almost leveled up just because of that. Alright, you dumb video game heroes, always pull this stuff. It's ridiculous. You think violence solves everything, don't you, huh? Don't you? Only sometimes. Wait, I'm missing chat. How cold is it here? I don't know. I haven't looked. Probably about the same. It's nice and toasty in this room because of the computer. This is Puddley's place, a humble little collar shop where folks mix stories and drinks. By the by, there's an inn upstairs. When you're weary, go up and relax. What is this? Ah, what are you doing? Sneaking up on a person as he sings most jovially? Who, me? You ask about? Ah, I am called Flavio. I am, how you say, a trader, the richest man in Rogueport. What? So, I mean, this is clearly a badge. This is the skull stone, the lucky charm of my family. I love you, you sparkly thing. It is so fabulous, I wish to give it great kisses. It never leaves my sights, never. Okay, never mind. It's Toadsworth. Oh, well, well, Master Mario, what could a highness be doing? The mind reels. Please don't waste another moment. You must find the prisoners. You must. All right. In coupon. So then... Replenish health. <laughs> That's a nice animation. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay, never mind. I thought I could break in. The GameCube changes the background music to the original GameCube tracks. Oh, that's cool. I mean, I'm not going to have nostalgia for it because I never played the original, but that's it's cool that they added that. Yeah, yeah, I'm good. So I know where this is. The chest is like... Oh yeah, there's no way to get it that way. Alright, anyway. I thought it might have been this Goomba. Apparently there's someone visiting from the town that I want to get to. I guess we'll see. <laughs> you got our plan. Oh yeah, no, that's fine. You don't have any good jobs, do you? You know, easy work, great pay. Or at least something easy. I don't do he any heavy lifting. And I gotta get paid cash. No. Hey, it's that guy again. Have you been powering up your party members? If you don't, they're gonna have a rough time as you keep adventuring. I haven't, but um, do I even have the ability to do so? Oh, I can. You'll be able to use Shell Shield to protect Mario. She'll be able to use Multi Bonk to attack a foe multiple times. 
multi bonk. Shazibi. Shazibi. I don't have any more. I wish I could. Yeah, so she says, let's find a pipe that connects with Boggly Woods. There's probably one underneath Roadport. Then the moment you're in the underground... Now she says, have you ever seen one of the little creatures from Boggly Woods? I hear they visit this town sometimes. Or are they referring to this town? I don't know. My next path. Focus, focus, focus! Cabra, what? Cabra da, abra, hullabaloo. Jeez, I'm not reading that. Your distant path. In the town sewers, you will find a place where you once spotted a small creature. Near the place where it ran away, you can enter through a small gap by turning... Oh. Dude, that's why I don't remember. <laughs> so it was last stream. It's the downside of having a gap. It's just sometimes you forget. Oh, that's nice. That's much quicker. Oh yeah, here. Okay, and then this, okay. Mario, did you see that? That was one of the things Professor Frankly described. All right, we're on our way. Don't eat me. Huh? Ah, uh, you didn't come to eat me? And you're not bullies? <laughs> of course not. For real? Ugh. Boy, that's good. I thought for a second I might have an accident. You're one of the creatures from Boggly Woods, right? What are you doing here? Oh, what? Why do you know about me? No, you must be... You guys are working for those x noughts aren't you? You chased me here. No, it's the end. x noughts easy there, kid. What in the world are you freaking out about? We're not going to do anything to you, so just chill for a sec. Just tell us what's going on. Well, okay. This gang of bad guys who call themselves x noughts came to where I live. They came inside our great tree and started tearing it apart and causing trouble. So, I've come all the way here looking for help. Mario, that sounds like those guys who attacked us in Rugport, right? If they're the same guys, then they're definitely after the Crystal Star. Now that you mention it, they did say something about some Crystal Star thingy. But we punies don't know anything about any crystals or stars. Say, could you guys help us out? Maybe chase them off? If you do, we'll give you, uh... What was it? The Crystal Star? If you do, we'll have the Puny Elder give you that. I don't know what it is, but if it'll help us reclaim our tree, I'm sure the Elder will agree. 
<laughs> what do you say? Let's not waste any more time. I'm begging you. Really? You aren't joking? You'll do it? I guess. I mean, we can't ignore them, right? And we do need to find the crystal star before those X whatever guys do. Oh, thank you so much. This is great. I'm so happy. My name is Punio. Pleased to meet you. I'll take you to where I live. Follow me, okay? This is the way. Oh, it's this way. But I can't. Wait, hang on a second. I'm sure the puny elder said some button around here opened the secret entrance. Aha! That badge sounds amazing. Oh, I still have one more remaining point. Hold on. Alright. Increasing defense when I successfully guard. That's good. You can get to the woods we puny lives in, live in by going through that pipe. Okay, hurry, hurry. Great boggly tree. This looks nice. I thought it was going to be a snow level, but it's just white flowers. These are the boggly woods. They sure look boggling. Ooh, I've got butterflies. Um, okay, just a bit farther, and we should be able to see the great tree. The elder and her friends are waiting for us there. Oh, and my little sister too. Come on, let's go. I must obligatory look for secrets. Oh, it's them. <laughs> Time to go to work, lovelies. Vivian, you understand what we've got to do, yes? Mm hmm A, find that Mario guy, and B, steal the map to the Crystal Stars, right? We can just do away with Mario and his friends, can't we? Or is that bad? Oh, bad things happen all the time, Vivian, but you're right about our goals. If my information is correct... Mario should be coming down this road quite soon. You must ambush him here and get that map. Hmm? What's this now, Vivian? What's that? You're fawning over there? Oh, you mean this? I found it near that tree over there a while back. Isn't that a gorgeous necklace? It was so lovely, I just had to pick it up. Vivian, for shame, picking up someone's scraps. Disgusting. Greedy. But enough about that, Vivian, my dear pack rat. Bring out the sketch of that Mario guy that you got from Grotus. Mwahihi. Eat poor... What? I, I don't have that. You said it was way too important, so you took it. You should have it. Don't be ridiculous. I don't have a, such a thing. You are in charge of it. You wretched little worm, blaming me for something you probably screwed up. But I... Go, go! Oh, what is it, Marilyn? Ah, what's that, mustachioed fellow? 
This is no time for such nonsense, you great oaf. Save your games for later. Oh, now, where was I? You, Vivian. Don't tell me you lost our precious sketch. But listen, I... It's not my fault. I never had to sketch. Silence, you dits! Such impudence. How dare you talk to me like some rebellious child. It's clear to me that the only rationale you understand is force. For your punishment, I'll be taking that necklace you just found. Yes, so sorry. But, but, Beldum? Oh, you're horrid. What is it, Mr. Mustache? Leave us. Scram right now. I have no business with you. <laughs> oh, what am I to do? Uh, go. Go. Are oh, they going... Oh! I was going to say, are they going to realize... So with these things are how to use power block. I don't have to use a fine. Power block. Problematic. Oh, it did stylish. Okay, I know how the stylish version of that works. That's a pale piranha. You know about these guys, the famous piranha plants? This colorless subspecies is adapted to the boggly woods. Ah, the wonders of nature. Max HP 4, attack is 2, defense is 0. If you try to jump on them, they'll totally chomp on you. Oh, she has more HP now, I just noticed. Thanks to the power up. Okay, I know how to do stylish hammer. Unfortunately, she can't really help. Level up! I'm getting badge points. I want to use that one where it's um, just free swap out. Speaking of, I should probably... Yeah. That's a nice one, because then it kind of makes up for the fact that I did yeah! didn't level up health. <laughs> yeah, no.
Damn it. Oh, I always mess up that one. Okay, I mean, useful. Damn it. There we go. Um, I should probably swap partner here. Then Coops can actually do something. Surprise the villains didn't follow us. What's this? There, can you see it? That big tree. That's what I was telling you about. That's where we punies live. That's home. Uh, of course, it's not just us in the tree. Lots of jabbies and piders, too. Well, anyway, Mario, follow me. Uh, before we do... Mr. Mini Mini? Mini Mr. Mini? Temporarily makes enemies tiny, dropping their attack power. Yeah. Rare stuff. I mean, the, the Mini Mini, sure. Just checking. If there was anywhere to be star pieces hidden, it would probably be here. That's a heck of a door. <laughs> well, this place, like, an advanced security system. These punies don't mess around. Uh, well, take a look. This door wasn't here before. Someone just installed it. And I can't open it. I thought I could finally save everyone. I'm a fool. Hey, don't Take it so hard. It does look sturdy, though. What do we do now? Uh. Um. Hmm. Um. Hmm. Hmm. Got it, Mario. Over here. Long ago, the puny elder told me about a secret entrance somewhere around here. We'll get in that way. Uh, problem is, I doubt finding it is going to be easy. I mean, it won't be labeled secret entrance. Not to be a worry, Wart, but how in the heck can we find a secret entrance? 
Well, it's hidden by this invisible thingy. We need to find and remove the thingy. Boy, but removing a normal thingy sounds tough enough, let alone an invisible one. Eh. Oh, got it. Flurry. Surely Madame Flurry's powers can help us. Flurry is a refined and dignified lady who lives in these woods. The Elder says she's a wind spirit who can wield powers of air with ease. You see where I'm going with this? She can use wind power to blow the thingy away. Well, it won't have to try. Flurry lives in the deepest corner of the woods, so... Let's head back in the direction we came from. Ah, these woods are the most wonderful in all the world. Yes, indeed. Building a house here was just the finest idea I ever did have. Oh, my, yes. This place is so different from the bright flash bulbs of the world, and I am used to such peace. This negative image of the real world soothes my body and soul. But what's even better is that I, Madame Flurry, grow ever more lovely here. Plus, those squishy, adorable little punies that live in that tree are so nice to me. But I suppose if I stay here too long, I'll begin to crave the hustle and bustle before long. Oh, oh my, it's happening even as I speak. Already I feel the need for drama. That moment of exhilaration when the spotlight shines down on the stage. On me. Surely I was born to be an actress for the ages. It's settled then. I shall rise again, but before I make my stage comeback, I simply must whip my body and mind into shape. I'll just have to put on some makeup and my beauty even and make my beauty even more beautiful. Jeez. Wait a moment. <laughs> No, it's gone. Gone, I tell you, my... my... Your what? Mirror? Makeup? <laughs> if we head east from here, we'll see Flurry's place in no time. But it, is it the woods doing that? Okay, there has to be a way to beat these things. Yeah, that's right! But how do we... Oh, there we go. It has to be a super hammer. I want to find out about it. Knowledge is power! That's a dark puff. It's basically a tiny, mean thunderhead. Max HP 3... Attack 2, defense is 0. Sometimes it'll charge itself with electricity. Don't touch it when it does. Youch. You know what I mean? <laughs> Shocking. After it charges itself, it'll totally zap you with lightning. Beat it as fast as you can. So by touch, I assume hammer's okay. Because we're not touching it. It's wood. It doesn't conduct electricity. Okay, good. It just means don't jump on it. Oh my god. Just don't jump on it. I need that badge that lets me swap partners without losing the action. Wrong button. I 
didn't want to use this pipe, but what is it? Oh, paper. This was the. Oh. <laughs> okay. No, that was great. I got the stylish one, even though I failed. Okay, this is a problem. I'm guessing that becomes more useful when well, we, we get this wind ability, whatever it is. Oh. Or that. That works. Just two more. Quite hammer, damaging all enemies on ground or ceiling. Oh, there's quite a few of these that are useful. I need to get more badge points. No! Toads want blood! Yeah. Wow, it didn't work. Wait, what is that? The effect of the charm increases your defense by three. Damn. I'm glad I paid for that. Got the stylish. Uh oh, I should have used power. I thought normal hammer would do a lot. Okay, as long as I keep guarding. Drink some tea. Ow. That was a waste. <laughs> All 
I drank the tea not knowing that this was around the corner. Oh well. It's use it or lose it. Is she going to kiss Mario so far? Mario's been two for two. Uh, excuse me. Um, maybe she isn't here. I wonder if she went for a walk in the woods. Madam Flurry, hello? If you're here, say something. <laughs> Such a vandal. Eek! No, how to the question? You mustn't come in here. Uh, Madam Flurry, uh, are you there? Is that you? What are you doing? Oh, wait a moment, those darling, squishy little footsteps. Is that you, Punio? Oh, it's been an age since I saw you last. You poor dear, is there something you need? Ah, well, the thing is, we have a problem. The great tree's entry hall is blocked. My puny friends are trapped inside, so they're in a pickle and Mario needs these crystal stars. It's a train wreck, really. That's why we need you to come with us and find the secret entrance, Madam Flurry. Oh, is that all, dearie? You came all the way here just for that? My adorable little punio. You know, you know I would do anything in my power to help you. However, lamentably, I am in a bit of a bind myself. I just cannot come out. Gee, is this something wrong? It's somewhat embarrassing, but I never go out without my favorite necklace. I just can't find the blessed thing. I suspect I dropped it on my daily constitutional. I'd be simply scandalized if anyone saw me without it, so I shan't be going out. I absolutely must have that necklace to highlight my beauty, and that's that. Gee whiz, that must be some nice necklace, huh? Hang on. You know what? It's weird. I'm sure I just heard someone talking about a necklace. What's that? Do speak up. You, whoever just spoke, do you have any clue as to my necklace's whereabouts? If you do, you must help me. Please, be a dear, find it and bring it back to me. After that, I will most certainly join you and help my squishy little friend, Punio. Don't worry, Madam Flurry. I'm sure Mario can find your necklace. Word is, he's super. You can do it, right, Mario? Sure. <laughs> Great, it's decided then. Let's go find it. I'm sorry to trouble you so. <laughs> Beldum, I told you, you blamed me for losing the sketch, but you had it. Silence, you twit. Now is not the time to get hung up on stupid details. You must study this sketch. Wow, this Mario guy looks so manly. Check out that bushy mustache. So handsome. You know something, though, my lovelies? I swear I've seen this gentleman before. Ah, he's missed the mustache. Gah. Gah. Ah, I don't believe this. Vivian, without a doubt, all your fault. I'll be dealing out some strict punishment later, my dearie. Oh, yes, I promise you that. Uh, what? But that's, that's not fair. You're the one who had the... Silence, you squirrel brain. Don't you cop that insolent attitude of me. Ugh, this is not fair. And about that necklace, I was thinking of returning it to you, but no more. Aww. And since you caused this problem, you have to figure out how to find this Mario chump. Mm, go. It's okay.
Thumbic Relief villains. Nope. Although, mind you, I should probably grind. I changed my mind. Um... Stylish, yeah! Stylish, yeah! <laughs> I got... I got it. Man, it's so hard to block that one. <laughs> Even though I fail it, still stylish. Everything, but at the same time, can't fall behind. Gotcha. As long as it's stylish. Guard. Swap it. Seems to have lost the timing on the hammer. See, these ones are worth fighting because I can reliably guard. Smash. Okay. Oh, oh what? How did that miss? I wonder if this would work. Probably not, right? Fire rock. Yeah. 
This didn't work either. Oh, there's no downside. Yeah, I'm running. That's probably going to eat up too much of my health. Well, if it isn't Mario. Shiny mustache or not, you can't be too bright if you came here looking for us. <laughs> and you know why, because we were waiting for you. <laughs> I remember. They're the ones with... Hey, wait a second. What do you mean you've been waiting for Mario? That sounds suspicious. <laughs> we have no quarrel with you. But I simply cannot allow you to hunt for the crystal stars. And so I'll be taking that little map of yours just as soon as I deal with you. Whoa, wow, scary lady. How do you know about the map and the crystals? Maybe talk to Princess Peach or something? Hey, now that I think about it, who are you anyway? <laughs> Those who seek names are often disappointed, but if you insist, we'll tell you. We are... The three... Shadow Sisters. The three Shadow Sisters? Vivian, you nincompoop! What are you babbling about? It's just... Shadows. The three shadows. Sisters makes us sound less mysterious and less scary. How many times must I remind you? Ah, oh, all right, sis, I'm sorry. It just makes me really happy when you call me your sister, sir. How insufferably sappy. Oh, you've got some fierce punishment coming your way. Ah, oh, gee whiz, I hate being punished. That's for later, though. First, we have to deal with this Mario and his friends. Let's do it, my lovelies. Marilyn! Vivian! The might of the three shadows, relation with Held, will be more than enough to win the day. Oh, okay. Go. It's most unlucky that our tights are set on you. Well, unlucky for you, of course. Marilyn, Vivian, show them precisely what we can do. Go. Yes, sis. Um, in hindsight, I probably should have had Goombella out. That's Vivian. She's the youngest of the three shadows. Max HP 10, attack is 1, defense is 0. She doesn't seem all that noteworthy. Uh, she is kind of cute, I guess. She might even be cuter than I am. I guess. Wow. I think I might be jealous. <laughs> this is why I do it. Like, I like the flavor text she brings. Jeez, that was a punch to the face. Suck a punch. Read all the lore. That's Marilyn. She's one of the three shadows, Beldum's younger sister. Max HP 12, attack 2, defense 0. She charges up her attacks occasionally. Says here she's the toughest of the sisters, so it might be best to defeat her first, huh? Other than that, she doesn't seem have any other particularly outstanding characteristics. I'm only here to tattle on you. 
Look at how shy, <laughs> tiny she is. That's Beldum. She's the oldest sister. The leader of the three shadows. Max HP 9, attack 1, and defense 0. But her blizzard attack has an attack of 2. She can make her partners big and us tiny. And attacks us with weird magic. The worst thing about her is that sinister snicker. She sounds totally evil. I mean, she's just the sort of person you want to avoid, like, the plague, you know? Earth Tremor. It's okay. I got to the next phase at least. That's cool. How much it stretched. This is great. Oh. Whoa, okay. Oh, no. It does nothing. What are you doing, Vivian? You twit, I'll never forgive you if you lose. Sorry, sis. Oh, okay. Uh-oh. Good God. Ha ha, I healed it right away. Sorry, sis. Hit him, Marilyn, now. Go. Uh oh. Oh, nice. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I have a fan. They were not happy about that. Wait. I don't have enough multi-bonk. Hold on. Just do the head bonk. Go! Go! Time to stop toying with you, hmm? Damn. Sh <laughs> she hits pretty hard now. Maybe we're just a touch calm, overconfident. Marilyn, Vivian, you lumps. We would have won if you two pulled your weight. Both of you prepare for a world-class punishment session when we get home. Go. Uh, but the necklace. Leave it. There we go. That's Flurry's necklace. Yes, let's take it to her. Good. 
Um, yeah, I'm not gonna fight that. But piranha plants and stuff, sure. Those things are a waste of time. No! Ah! Jumping pipe. Same button. Wait, didn't I get that? I thought I got that. Yeah, she is stronger than Mario at the moment. <laughs> I thought that was pick it up. I'm an idiot. <laughs> I did it again. I have not gotten that jackpot more than once. I mean, we're close to a level up. I should get it. I haven't figured out the, uh, the stylish bonk yet. I know it said to press it at the tip of the jump, but I haven't been able to get it. Oh, poor, poor me. When, oh, when will I see my precious necklace again? Oh, you delightful fellow, you found my necklace. I'm beside myself, truly. But you still mustn't see me. Please leave the necklace by the door and wait a moment. Oh, splendid, splendid, oh, so ravishing necklace, I'm awash in joy. Excuse me? Oh, oh my god. <laughs> what? What is this character design? Why is she so thick? Oh, oh my word, Mario, isn't it? Are you my heroic little necklace? He's, he's going to get kissed, isn't he? Well, my, 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 aren't you a fine specimen of, of a man? Yes, indeed. I simply must thank you for your 
graciousness. But how to do it? Perhaps if I grabbed you and gave you a little sugar? <laughs> Here I come, handsome. Time to give you a proper thank you. Pucker up. So, is everyone just going to do that to him? Oh, Mario, you are just the cutest little thing I've ever laid eyes upon. Yes, you are. And that's that. So tell me, are you truly looking for the crystal stars? The very same crystal stars spoken of by all the low lowlifes in Rogueport. Hmm, a danger-filled search for beautiful jewels. How absolutely marvelous. And here I was thinking how frightfully bored I was. It's time for a change. And besides, I do declare that plush mustache of yours has completely swooned me. A man as manly as you must attract all sorts of trouble and I want to keep you safe. So I dare say I'll be joining you on this little adventure. I assume that's fine, Mario. <laughs> what is that power? While pressing X, Flurry will exhale a strong gust of wind that can blow things away. Oh, cool. If she blows in the direction of an enemy, she can make its head spin for a bit. That's neat. She can also squash enemies in battle with a body slam or blow them away with gale force. She's like a thick genie. This is wonderful. It's so nice that Flurry likes you, Mario. Really, it's great. And even more importantly, Flurry's chosen to join us. Let's go to the great tree. Everyone wants a piece of Mario. She was so thick she couldn't fit through the fence. Alright, let's see it. See, that one is definitely smack. Okay. Let's see how this does. Wait. Oh, I get it. It's kind of hard to see. It's like a rocking back and forth sort of thing. Okay, one more battle. Oh! This'll do it. The fact that this is basically like a like a rhythm game. <laughs> oh, I haven't I haven't uh, not noticed that. Okay. 
Um, so let's see. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. We can get rid of that, because we have that skill elsewhere. The damage dodge one is really good. I mean, I don't want to get rid of that. I guess that's fine. I like the idea of quick change. Bring you all the up to the moment news as it happens. We have details of yet another incident at the parlor in West Rogueport. Outraged by the Pianta prices, Goomfrey is suspected of violently shaking the Pianta's changer, causing the Pianta's changer alarm to sound, which led to the Pianta changer ceasing to function for a brief period. The parlor was forced to close down temporarily. The victim was quoted as saying, I'm a machine. No matter how hard I'm shook, I feel no pain. End interview. Shop reporter go, get all the hot hottest shopping news about all the hottest shopping spots in the world if Petalberg is your destination you can't miss a shop that's been the talk of the town for the last 20 years nifty shop okay that's it I mean sure this is a good point to reach this because um I just leveled up so <laughs> it says secret entrance. That's the secret entrance. We can finally get inside. Here I go. Didn't they say it wasn't going to have secret entrance? Aren't punies just the most precious little things? Mario, if I must ask, did you know that I used to be a rather famous actress? I was a diva of the stage. I was known as Madame Flurry the world over. But... The filthy air outside, the spotlight repelled me, so I came to the woods. And soon enough I glimpsed the beauty of these punies and their pure little hearts. It reminded me of my own innocence as an actress, and that made me realize... I shall ever love the stage, I must feel the spotlight shine on me again, I must! As you can see, these dear little punies helped me find my true self. That's why I must help them however I can before I go on my own adventures. Mario, can you hear me? Check it out. I was able to open it from the inside. Come on, over here. The time has come for me to repay my debt to the punies. Come along, Mario. Hurry up, go inside. Vandalism. Ah, uh, hmm, weird. Normally, everyone's right here. What the hey? Hey, Elder, everyone, come out. Hello? Wow. Who are you guys? How'd you get in here? Whoa, dude. Is that... Isn't that... Isn't he that Mario guy? What? He is. We better get him then. Dude. Lord Crump told us to get him immediately if we found Mario, remember? You idiot, use your head. If we capture him, we'll get all the credit, man. Duh. Oh yeah, right on. Let's rock this chump. One, two, three, break! This is 
great. Because now this can happen. That's an X knot. It says here it's classified as an enemy combatant. That description stinks. You think it means they're just low level foot soldiers? Max HP 4, attack 3, defense 0. They drink these potions that make them all big and burly when they attack, then they attack. One's easy, but if there's two or more, you better watch out. Use your partner's move as an item to take them down. Power smash. I mean, at this point, she is the strongest. <laughs> Crud. That stung, man. Dude, maybe reporting back to Lord Crump isn't a bad idea after all. Pretty slick work handling those guys, Mario. Seriously, where'd it go? But the question remains, where did everybody go? What could possibly make everyone leave? Finally, somebody shows up. What are you doing hiding back there? Come out for Pete's sake. I found us a powerful ally. He, he's huge. Uh, are you sure your huge mustachioed man won't try to eat us? Huh? Hey, who's that? Who else is back there? He's massive, I don't like him, he'll crush us, dangerous! Nice stash, it scares me so barely. Now don't worry everyone, this is Mario, and he's our friend, he's here to help. All those bad guys, Mario will stomp every one of them, just like the last goons. Is this it? There are so few. Well, we'll have to make do. Let me formally introduce Mario. Wait. How do we really know this burly fellow is our ally? He might be one of them. Juniper, what are you saying? He's not one of them. Listen, we can all fight alongside Mario and chase those goons out of here. We can take back our tree. Huh. Big bad punio, listen to yourself trying to sound all important like. You have no idea the kind of troubles we've been going through while you were gone. And why are there so few of you here anyway? What happened to everyone? Well, they've been captured by those goons. The elder, everybody, including your sister. What? Petuni? Everyone was captured and taken somewhere within this big tree. They said it was because we wouldn't tell them where to find some crystal thing. We told them we'd never heard of it. Oh. Well, that absolutely tears it. We've all got to go look for them right away. What are you saying, Punio? We can't do anything to those giant goons. And adding this hairy old man to our ranks won't help a bit. How can you say that? You can't know that. We have to try, don't you see? Think about it. If we all get together, we can take on anyone, anywhere. So who's with me, huh? Come on, everyone. Let's pull our strength. <laughs> punio, punio, punio. You'll have to convince me because I think you're losing it. Tell you what. You and Mr. Mustache there can get the revolution started. If you can free our friends who got locked up somewhere in the tree, then I'll join your little crusade. Ha! <laughs> like that'll ever happen, please. Fine, we'll show you. Right, Mario, right? Come on, follow me to glory. Let's go help them. I got the feeling we're gonna need her. Just a hunch. Wow. 
ten. Sorry. Ah, something must fit here. Okay. Ten something. It's like inverse Kirby. See if this works. <laughs> this is great. I can get to jump on them. What is, is that? A fidget spinner? <laughs> what do you mean, fidget spinner? That's a yucks. It says here it's a creature created in the X Not Labs. Max HP three, attack two, defense zero. According to this, attacks and items won't affect it if it has a mini yuck around it. So if any mini yucks appear, take those out first. Duh. Okay. Um. Yeah. I mean, the recommendation was take these dudes out first. Okay, I see. Um, hold on. Pop. Yeah. Ah, man, I haven't gotten it once. Other than that one time. I mean, at least now I can freely swap between the characters and not be penalized. Okay. No. Her, her skills are good. Tactics, swap partner. She does more damage. Can't get the stylish, the stylish bonk. You know what? I'll just stick with her until I see something. It's the Elder. Elder! Junior, is that you? You're looking well. Why are you so calm, Elder? You're trapped. And this is our daring rescue of you. Oh, rescuing, is it? Well, thanks, I suppose. Those are quite exciting. But I, I think you ought to help the other punies before you rescue me. Where are the others? Uh, let me think, uh, where was I? Uh, yes, right. Your question. Uh, the rest of the punies, unfortunately, are locked away in the other cell. I don't mind telling you, those uncouth vile goons just have no consideration whatsoever 
for the elderly. None. None, I tell you. Honestly, I have to ask, what's a puny like me supposed to do in a situation like this, I ask you. Please, I want to know. But anyway, puny, listen. Yes, listen to your elder. I have to say something vital to you. Listen up. Hmm, let me think. Where was I? Ah, uh, yes. Right. Your question. Okay. Big brother. Is that my punio? Patoonie, thanks heavens. You're here, you're safe. I knew you'd come for me, punio. I just knew it. Of course I would, dear sister. And I've brought us a mighty ally. Look at him. We're going to get you out of here right away. I swear, just hold on tight a sec. Okay. Mario, listen, we got to find the cell keys or we're going nowhere. If this ends in a kiss, I'm... I'm ending. <laughs> That's it. It's going to be a game where everyone kisses Mario. Man, this is brutal. How much longer till we find that stupid crystal? Not even those punies we captured know anything about it. And they live here. And worst of all, I got stuck holding... Onto the stupid selkie. Uh, uh, so bored. Feel like a big old nap is in my near future. Um, ouch. Oh, well, isn't this a treat? We must stop meeting like this, don't you think? Hey, stop right there, missy. You're that thieving girl we saw before. What are you doing here? Well, anyway, I heard there were nice badges to be found here, so I came looking. Oh, come on. <laughs> but who cares about that? Lovely to see you again. Ew, not another smooch. This flirting is out of control. The precious crystal star you're looking for is beneath this tree underground. Good luck finding it before the others. Mm -hmm -hmm -hmm. Take care, my handsome stash superstar. Let's get together again soon. I can't believe that girl. Ugh, I can't stand her. Oh, my aching. Hey, you. You're that dirtbag who hit me from behind, aren't you? Yeah, real fair, you scum. You fight dirty, you get dirty. And I'll be doing the dirting. Everyone wants to kiss Mario. Yeah. Oh, that was only three XP. It's alright, she didn't steal everything. Ooh, okay. I may have to store that. That seems like something that will be useful at the end. Not right now. No one has 50 HP. Okay, red key. Elder, we're back. We're here to rescue you. Foolish child! Punio, sit down this instant and keep your mouth shut. Huh, what, why? Huh, what did I do? Uh, listen, Elder, I don't know why you're mad, but we came here to help you. Stop your mumbling, you, and mind your elders, you whelp. How could you abandon your poor sister and run off like that? Absolutely shameful. But, but Elder, I just went to find help. To help rescue you. Oh, stop with the whining. You never interrupt an elder mid-lecture. Never. You wonder why the other punies call you a doofus sometimes. That's why. And your time to be a doofus is over because you have to lead our puny tribe one day. That day is not far off and that is why you need to listen. Now, first of all... Several hours later... Oh, 
else? You got that now. From now on, you've got to act your. You got to get your act together, Puny. Yes, Elder. Yes, I understand. Bah, I only answer once. But say, by the way, why are you here anyway? Uh, I was just telling you we came to rescue everyone. We started with you, Elder. Oh, is that so? Well, good. In that case, get me out of here already. Criminy. The cell is cold, which isn't good for the old back. And there's this damn stench. It's probably him. <laughs> ah, well. There she goes. Oh, it's a she. Enough standing around. Just you wait, Petuni. I'll be right back for you. Okay, big brother, I'll be waiting. We need to find the blue key too, right, Mario? Let's go downstairs and ask the elder if she knows anything. And hope the answer is, you know, brief. One thing I should have done. Oh, no. <laughs> Damn it. I was going to look behind the pipe. Hold on. Ah, oh, okay. Disappointment. Thought there'd be a star shard. I mean, it looks like it's going to be a while, because... Well, maybe not. We'll see. I'm guessing I have to rescue ten of them. How's my health? Everything's fine. Well, if it isn't Punio. Hm, you heard me. Hm. I can't say I expected you to manage to rescue the Elder. I told you I could do it. Oh, don't get a swelled head. This doesn't mean I'll accept you as our leader. And it definitely doesn't mean I completely trust that mustache guy either. For starters, you still haven't rescued the other punies yet. I'm not lifting an antenna to help you until you do. You stop it, you! Despicable! How dare you talk like that, knowing what we're up against! The widow soldiers taking over our tree were bad enough, but now the Jabby tribe is helping them! We must stand together now, we must face them! Don't you understand that? What? The Jabbies and the intruders have joined forces? Then maybe the Jabbies have the blue key. Shut your trap, Juniper and Punio! Uh, mind me, you hear? You'll help Mustachio here. What'd you say your name was? Uh, it, it was Marty, wasn't it? Yes. It's Mario. He's Mario. I mean, she, she's only world famous. Come on. Yes, yes, simmer down, you two. And everyone else help Martio clear our tree out. All right, Alda, whatever you say. I'm not heartless or anything, uh, to tell you the truth, I'm worried about Petuni too. And you're right, we have no choice, we must fight. Right, everybody? There you go, my punies, that's the spirit! Oh, there you go. Thanks, you guys. Hey, if you're done rallying everyone, I have a question. We're looking for this crystal star thingamajig. Ever heard of it? The crystal sty. Oh. Did it do the old person voice? Yes, perhaps. Hidden down, down, down beneath the bottom of this tree is a funny colored stone. But what do we do with it? Oh, right. Guard it from evil and give it to a pure heart. That's what generations of elders have been taught. Might be the crystal star. Marty, or oh, Martio, I'm calling it. Your heart seems pure enough, so that funny colored stone is yours. I don't quite just see how... I don't quite see how just yet, but I bet all of this is connected to us getting our tree back. You got all that, Mario? Crystal star underneath the bottom of the tree? Go to it. 
<laughs> oh, hold your horses. I forgot something. Uh, before you can get to the Crystal Star, you must save all of the punies. Yep, you'll never get to that gem without the help of the punies. Not a chance. So here, you better take this puny orb. It's the symbol of our leader. If you place this in the pedestals, you'll see around the tree the punies will gather. Just remember to take the orb with you when you're done using it. Because, well, if you don't, everyone will just kind of hang out and stare at the orb. Alright, guys, let's go rescue everybody. I like the old person voice. I hope my voice doesn't become that eventually. Oh, and one more thing. So sorry, so sorry. I, I've awfully been forgetful of late. On your way to the Crystal Star, uh, if you lose any of the punies, just come see me. What I'll do is I'll give a whistle to call him back here. You got all that? A lot of reading. I don't mind it. I mean, I'll, I'll mess up a couple times and paraphrase, but you get the idea. This kind of makes up for the fact that I didn't do any reading in Yakuza I'm 6, I mean. Don't get me wrong, I love the fact that there was so much voice acting, it was great. But I do miss reading sometimes and doing dumb voices. Oh look, a new pipe, come on, let's jump in. <laughs> Just, it's so easy to get first strike with her. You gotta add voice actor to the resume. I mean, I don't think I can voice act. I can do funny voices. I make noises, but professionally, nah. Don't you dare throw garbage at me. Get out of my theater. I have been told a bunch of times that I should look into reading ebooks and stuff, but I don't think I could manage that. Like, yeah, you know, sometimes there are words that I don't pronounce correctly. And it's a result of just English not being the first language I learnt. What are they doing? Are they gonna teleport? Oh, I see. Do them in Spanish? No, my... It's not, like... Here's the thing. My Spanish is not fluent. Extremely fluent. Right? But, you know... It's, uh... It's a thing where, like... Every now and then, it comes out where it's like, oh... That's right, I learnt English second, and I can't pronounce this correctly. Like, obviously my most fluent language is English, but like, I'll mess it up! What is wrong with me? Okay, maybe I got this wrong. Dude. <laughs> Did I have to learn another language in school? I mean, briefly French and Japanese, but I have retained zero knowledge of that. I think this thing tricked me into needing to do something. Oh no, but this is where I came from, so hang on. Maybe I need to do something else. I 
guess it's a white here. That's a Pyta. Ick! They gross me out. Max HP 5, attack 2, and defense is 0. Ew! Besides its normal attacks, it might spit out 3 web wads at you consecutively. You better have good timing if you want to guard against its attacks. It also says here that the punies can't stand Pytas, so I'm not the only one. Does the sight of these things make punies flee in terror? I know how they feel. We have to take these things out. That's what it's saying. Oh, they have, yeah, 5 health. That's bad. Nice. Still can't get the stylish version of that attack down. When am I gonna replan trip to Japan? Probably next year. I can't this year for various reasons I don't want to go into. What's next year? I can get the hammer every time. But not the, uh... Okay, I missed that time. I haven't gotten the special bonk once. Maybe I need to read what... what it said about it. Just take it out. What is going on?
next time I go back into town, I have to talk to that character again and just see what it said about the the stylish jump. This area is good for XP. Wait, it says 10 out of 11. So I need to bring... I need to bring him here. But I, I didn't see how to get him... Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I think I know how. Is it really that simple? Just, I thought, <laughs> I thought that was luck. Oh, I see. No, but that doesn't, all right. It, the door's not important. Um, what I was going to try is this. Okay. Uh, oh, wait, what? Whoa! O okay, hang on, that did something. Oh, no, they're just here. Man, so what is this? I th I'm pretty sure it's right. It's just I need to blow the bubbles across. Hang on. That happens, and then... Yeah, look at that. Okay, there we go. And I've taken out the spiders, so they're not going to scare them. So I think what would have happened is they would have fallen to the lower level because they got scared of the spiders or something. Not sure what that'll achieve, but let's just leave it for now. <laughs> 11 out of 11 for what, though? Wow. I'll figure that out later. Oh, there's the blue key. Mario! That was a jabby! And I was right, they have the key to the blue cell. Our tribes have been enemies for a long time now. Every time we meet, we fight. A lot. And now, we know they're helping the intruders and trying to seize the tree. But I used to get along with Jabal. He's one of the jabby tribe. The Jabal I knew would be hiding somewhere right now, not wanting to fight anyone. I wonder if even Jabal is my enemy now. <laughs> Everyone, it's the Jabbies! It's a ch 10 Jabby squadron. Ah, uh, let's get them. Come on! like Pikmin. Wow, we did it. We defeated every last jabby here. 
Now we have to destroy the Jabby Hive Fortress. Am I gonna play Pikmin 2? Uh, eventually. Yes, yeah, so with this key we should be able to open the cell my people are locked in. Hurry, we have to free my sister and the others. Interesting. I mean, one does downtime. <laughs> Something that I don't want to play. And they'll never come back, and that's that. That's what's gonna happen to us, and... Hey! By the way, what's that thing you've been holding onto so tightly? It's a mushroom. Oh, not to be, you know, rude, but it looks dry and wrinkly and gross. Yeah, yeah, I know, I picked it so I could give it to my brother to eat. But then I got captured and stuck in here, and after a few days it dried out. Oh, really? Great story. Anyway, don't worry so much. All my complaining aside, I'm sure Punio will return. Yeah, I mean... After this, I'm not sure. Maybe after this. <laughs> we'll see how I feel. It also depends on the mood, because... I like the game, but admittedly, it, it did... It did, uh... Uh-oh. Okay, well, you know, we're going to have to, um... Do this, otherwise we are getting nowhere. Um, it did make me salty a little bit. Just, just a tad. Particularly when the little fellas, um, would just walk into danger despite my best efforts. Like, I did everything in my power to keep them alive. <laughs> they would still... Worse than lemmings. I don't even have to guard. Like, Mario's just a tank right now. I mean... It's hard, it's hard to decide what to play sometimes. Often I go with what I think is cool. Often it's a game I've been looking forward to. Sometimes it's a game I haven't played in a while. Sometimes it could be, oh, I want to play that game with someone. Sometimes it could also be like people have been requesting it for a while. It, it's hard to pick. Hang on. Must get rid of the spudars. I mean, ba like Banjo Kazooie. So here's the thing. Um, what was I gonna say? With Nintendo 64 games, the... I mean, in the long run, right? There's gonna be one of those consoles released that let you play the games in a better way. Sometime this year, if... I'm hoping sometime next... Next year, it'll be around, but I don't know. It was announced last year, but it would mean I could... play it region-free, so then... 
those expensive games that are just annoying to pick up just because in Australia they didn't sell that well or weren't released at all or released late. I don't know why, there's certain games, Nintendo 64 games, that are just stupidly expensive. But anyway, with this console, they're saying it'll be like 4K upscale, which neat, but then also region free. So then I could get American games in and they would work. Because currently, there's no way of doing that. And the price difference is, is that significant. I mean, I could just emulate them, but I don't know. I like playing the games and acquiring them originally. Oh, I finally got it. I haven't seen what this uh, upscaler does to the Nintendo 64, to be honest. Because I do have Banjo-Tooie, but I haven't really tested it with it yet. Bingo the name of the farmer or the dog. It could be either, thanks to the way English works. Like, you know, default logic dictates that it's referring to the dog, but it could also be that the person saying the sentence is bingo. Depends if you take things super literally. How? I saw this image today that showed hot dogs from all over the world, or what pe what con different countries do with hot dogs, and um, surprise, surprise, Australia wasn't on that list, <laughs> which I guess I'm not imagining it. It's like, we really don't do anything with hot dogs here. One hundred. I think it's better to... Yeah, this. We don't eat hot dogs. No, we do, but I mean, in the... We do. It's just, you won't see, like, a hot dog cart or something like that. Or a place, generally speaking, that, you know... Like, you know how you have Chicago-style hot dogs, for example? And New York-style hot dogs? There's no such thing as, like, a Victorian-style hot dog or a... Sydney hot dog or a Melbourne hot dog, right? A hot dog to us is just, you go to the supermarket, you get the hot dogs, and then you get the cheap buns and you just put tomato sauce on it. And that's it. I mean, there are some places that do them, but they're American style, right? They market them as American style, and there's not many places that do it. Is this a job for coops? Do I boil or grill? I mean, that's what I mean. The super supermarket ones are boil ones. 
but the thing we do here is like you get a sausage, right? And then you are. Uh... Because there's hot dogs and there's sausages, they're not the same thing. They're not the same thing, right? But something we do here is you get a sausage and you either cook it in a frying pan. How are we supposed to win? Um, or a grill, right? And then you just get a slice of white bread. You put the sausage in it and then you just put the tomato sauce, maybe some onions on it and that's it. <laughs> it's just... In school in particular, on Wednesdays, uh, a cart would arrive and sell that to the kids. Like, it was 50 cents for one. So you get two for a dollar. It's great. Now you want a hot dog? Don't let your dreams be dreams. Fulfill those hot dog fantasies. Especially if you can get something that's decent. Okay. Got the re grip and try again. What the? What, how do I beat this? Maybe we're at number. We may, oh, right. If we want to win, probably need more punies helping. Okay. Oh, we're supposed to go. We have the blue key. I'm an idiot. I was too busy talking about hot dogs. have hot dogs and all the toppings to make it amazing. It's just 9.30 in the morning. And breakfast hot dog. Like, you know, just breakfast hot dog. You can do it. Listen, if people from Texas can, like, make Mexican food that's typically not for breakfast a breakfast thing, you can make a breakfast hot dog. I had scrambled eggs and bacon for dinner, and it was great. Not today, but, you know, recently. Like, why? Why let society dictate it? It's... You're in your own home. And you want to eat that. Like, just eat it, man. I've had fried chicken for breakfast. Pizza for breakfast. Admittedly, the pizza is more breakfast-like because what I do is I heat it up in the skillet, the frying pan, so the bottom gets crispy and heated up, and then, you know, cook an egg over it. It's great. want the hot dog, have the hot dog for breakfast. That's all I'm saying. There were some interesting hot dogs that I saw on that image. Some of them weren't even in buns, like, there were a few that were in, uh, wraps. Like a hot dog wrap. Yeah, Australia just doesn't have hot dog culture. That's all it is. It's whenever hot dogs are mentioned, it's usually American style, that's it.
One of the best hot dogs I had recently, though, was, um, there's a place that does, like, Korean hot dogs. Not the corn dogs, right? But, like, it's a hot dog, and they add bulgogi on top of it. As an example. Really good. Big brother! Little Petuni. Are you alright? You're not hurt, are you? Nope, I'm fine. Thank heavens. Hey, big brother, I have something for you. I meant to give this to you sooner, but... Mushrooms are your favourite, aren't they, big brother, but... Well, this one kind of got dried out. Oh, nasty. Big brother! It was icky, wasn't it? I'm sorry. Uh, no, uh, mm, uh, uh, delicious, uh, uh, very uh, mm, uh, uh, yummy. Big brother, you okay? Uh, give me a hug, Petuni. Hey, quit it, Punia. Come on, don't get all mushy. Everyone's staring. Well, it was really just a sweet gesture, that's all. <laughs> it's hot dog time. Yeah. There are now 101. Alright, cool. This is like Pikmin. I just want to get to the end of this chapter. That's my goal. Uh, oh. Whoops. It's always a thing here. This, eventually the conversation will go to food. Wait, what am I holding on to? What does Mario hold on to? When she does that, what is he holding on to? Huh. He's holding on to something, I'm just not sure what. It's either like... Her butt or her, or her boob. <laughs> like, one or the other. It looks... Ugh, it looks that way. I don't know. It's not a hand? Yeah, I didn't think so. I mean, maybe it is. It just looks weird. Maybe her stomach? That's not much better. I've been watching Curb Your Enthusiasm, and there's an episode where Larry David almost falls off a roof, and he grabs onto this, uh, assistant's, uh, stomach. <laughs> Just to hang on. Jeez. Wait, where are they? Where are the rest of them? I only have 77. What happened? Oh my god. Really? 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 Okay. This is just as bad as Pikmin. <laughs> This is exactly what was happening in Pikmin. Oh, 
Have I tried making the pancake? No, I mean... It's not going to be an anytime soon thing. It'll be whenever I... feel the need. I also need to buy certain things to be able to make it. Such as a mixer. <laughs> I don't have one. God, it's mayhem. Do I have the recipe? Somewhere. Well, we beat them. We care every last jabby here. Now let's destroy the jabby hive fortress. Near the end here. Oh, it appeared on top of me. Oh, they're in the audience. That's neat. Um, I guess ye we're using coops. Got in the hang of most of the stylish moves except the jump one. It doesn't really matter too much now, but if I need to get my star points back from using specials, then yeah, it's going to matter later. No idea. There's probably some skill I'm missing. Oh, come on! <laughs> You've got to be kidding. Okay, there's enough of them to warrant this. Oh, man. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's overkill, but, you know. Back. <laughs> to make your hot dog. That was quick. 101. <laughs> Good job. Uh, what? What just happened? <laughs> Man, you guys are dense. Brilliant little trap, huh? And boy, did you bite on it. I saw you sticking that silly stone on the pedestals. So I made a fake one. Awesome. 
I mean, I knew it. It was great, but seeing you fall for it really gives me a warm, fuzzy feeling. Ba 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 ha ha. Talk about complete idiots. You guys are so dumb it hurts. Uh, anyway, with you fools out of the picture, I can take my time hunting the crystal star. Ba 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 ha ha. Mario, what do we do? Well, we have to find a way out of here. But what can we do? I guess... Oh, yeah. Paper. Boy. One sec. What's this? Wait, you see those? I'm pretty sure we've seen columns like those before. Uh, oh. Ah, whoa, 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 the tree just shook. What was it, an earthquake? Um, what? Snowflake, moon, creature, star. I took a screenshot of it, but... Snowflake, moon, creature, star. Man, now I'm kind of hungry. It's okay. I'll be fine. I'll do this to myself. Wait, door. Oh no, but this is a different door. My bad. Super boots. Toadette. Hey there, I'm Toadette. Congratulations on getting the super boots. You'll be able to use a new jump technique now, so let's practice it, okay? If you press A at the right moment when jumping, you'll do a spin jump. The trick is to press A right after you jump. Oh, that was a ground pound, not a spin jump. That's perfect, you're unnatural. Why did they call it a spin jump? That's a ground pound, no? Am I, uh, am I wrong? I mean, I guess... Technically spins before... I wouldn't call that a spin jump, that's, that's a ground pound. Yeah, that's a ground pound. I was so confused. Oh. 
down again. Yeah. Been playing platformers since the age of five. This is a thing. No? Really? Okay, never mind. Excuse me for uh, using my imagination. Yeah. That's fine. You did it! Yes, yes! Now we can get out of here! So I had to move them out of the way. That's all that did. <laughs> Just so I could see it. this way. So these things are like moths. Like, they see a shiny object and... Wait, but they're not coming down. Why not? Oh, no, wait, I know. Duh. I forgot. Wait, how? I mean, they're like moths, and they're not actual moths. Just similarity. Shiny object. Blindly just head towards it. Try her attack. Oh, 
Oh. No, but I still a ground pound. <laughs> I thought maybe I was going to do the spin jump there, but no, it's the ground, still a ground pound. What is this terminology? Well, maybe it was that, or, I mean, you know, this game is old, technically. Maybe it was before that convention was established. The wind thing also didn't seem to work on them, so... See, that was dumb. I shouldn't have wasted. I think, and I think Mario does more damage now with these boots. Yeah, okay, it's fine. Alright. Hey, Gami, what's up? Oh. This area makes me feel like I'm exploring a watery swamp, even though we're in a tree. Oops. Gotta... Wait, how are we gonna do this? Hmm. This is different. It's gonna drain the water, but like, hmm. What? I mean, I got it, but hang on. What am I doing? No, okay, that's not that's not the answer. It's <laughs> not the answer. What is the answer? Whoops. Hang on, let me go back up. I just want to make sure there's no hidden... Okay. Just making sure. This is where we need to end up. Yeah, I don't know then what they did. <laughs> oh my god. Well done. What? Oops. Oh, duh. There we go.
treasure. I keep pre huh? Oh no, that <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. I get it, I get it, I get it. Okay, now they can cross. And I can probably yeah. <laughs> There's a way. Just have to, just have to be tactful about it. <laughs> okay, and now we go in here. I hope they all came with me. Ah, what? Oh no, what's happening? So that's how you get into this room. Okay, uh, let's get Goombella out. Ready for that analysis. Oh, we may have already analyzed this, dude. Hmm, <laughs> let me see. That's... Things gotta be around here somewhere. Uh huh? What's that? Oh, sounds like a mob. Better clear out. Oh, I didn't bring the orb. <laughs> I like moths. They don't even sit still and stare at it, they're just moving rapidly. There we go. Wow, Mario, check it out, the Crystal Star. Score! Oh. Hey you, jerk! Mario, it's that weasel! Bah, bah, ha, 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 ha. Man, am I lucky or what? Or am I just good? Oh, you say you need a Crystal Star? Lord Crump, boom! Falls right in my lap. And still, this is humiliating. You shouldn't have been able to escape that cell. So, for insulting my awesome trap, I'm gonna repay you with a little present. Know what it is? Oh, just a little something I like to call a remote time bomb detonator! I'm gonna use this to bury you and those squirmy punies in rubble. Sound fun? Well, enjoy your final minutes inside this dank old tree, and with that, pow, I'm gone. Oh no, it's for real, isn't it? This is so not cool. We gotta get out of here right now. I, uh... <laughs> I forgot the punies. See, they're still staring at the stone. Oh my god, the time is real time. Um, okay, no, 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 oh, why, why? Oh, this is the first I'm seeing of this. Okay, good level. 
I was gonna say if it cuts into the time. Okay, we're going flower points this time. I think health is fine. I haven't struggled. Hold on, I'm an idiot. <laughs> I left him there to die. I've wasted 30 whole seconds. I don't know, I thought they'd use some common sense. <laughs> Man. Apparently common sense doesn't exist here. Is it horrible that I don't remember? Uh-oh. <laughs> that I don't remember the way out. <laughs> oh no. Oh yeah, no, no map, no map or anything. Just hey, remember, remember everything. Every last detail of the tree. It's not like every room looks very similar to one another. Oh, you're kidding, I'm gonna have to do this. Happened. No, that one got. Uh, why? <laughs> why? 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 Hey. This is this is exactly like um. Wait. Why is it only 78? Why is it only 78? <laughs> oh my god, what happened? I'm, I'm gonna have a conniption. Why is it only 78? Where, where are the rest of them? <laughs> what do you mean? Where <laughs> are the rest of them? Dude. Okay, there is a pause. I lost them all. I don't know where they are. Weren't they with me? Those they, they were with me, weren't they? I'm dropping down. No, they're not here. What? 78. Oh my god, oh. <laughs> oh this is this is just like Pikmin all over again. Why is this allowed? Yeah, they didn't follow, they got stuck somewhere. Good AI is good. Do I need all one and one? I would assume so. Okay, this is this is the entry room. So what happened? What happened?
What happened? I have, I have less than a minute. Okay, I'm hoping I press that button. Maybe a bug? Oh my god, don't say it. <laughs> Why? Why is that allowed? Okay. Why? Why did they not follow me? <laughs> We're not going to make it. <laughs> I, I have to blow them. I have to blow them into bubbles. I still have another floor to climb. Good, good. I'm screwed. And so Mario died. The end. Oh my god. No, but 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 but, but, but there's only twenty. Oh wait. Wait a minute. Right, get the orb. <laughs> get the fucking orb. Okay, 101. <laughs> do you see why, like, I'm hesitant to play Pikmin 2? Do you see? Do you see? Just imagine that on a larger scale. <laughs> you won't be going any farther this way. Are you for real? Move it, you old geezer! What? Did you just call me an old geezer? Where'd you get off talking like that? Got my respect, brat. Don't think my age has a thing to do with my might. Even if it kills me, I won't let you through. I'm ready! Elder power, activate! Whoa, what's your problem, Grandma? You got an ear... hair tickling your brain or what? Uh, oh, oh, ouch, can't take another step. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, oh, my back. What a time for my back to start acting up. You hothead old coot. You dare defy me. I could shine my boots with you. With the, what do you mean? What? We were watching... What? What? We were watching the cut... What? 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 <laughs> what? Why? Because I... What? What happened? Hold on, hold on. I'm skipping through this quickly. I wasn't paying attention to the timer. What? What happened? Am I that tired? I just didn't see what happened. There was at least a minute left on the clock. Runs, did you really think we'd let a wretch like you escape? I do believe you'll be handing over the crest, that crystal star, promptly exiting the tree. Can someone tell me what happened before? Like, did I honestly run out of time because I was reading? I think I did. No, 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 we need to skip through. Oh, there we go. 
Okay, you pass. One pummeling coming up with extra fists. Metal fists, that is. Really? Because I watched the cutscene. Is that a Pokeball? <laughs> okay. Awake, Magnus von Grapple. Time for a technological thrashing. Enjoy. Okay. Yeah, I mean, excuse me for trying to watch the story in an RPG. Are you crying yet? Yeah, sorry, but this thing isn't armed with tissues. Well, Magnus Von Grapple has that effect on people. Total weeping terror. And you ain't seen nothing yet. Check out the power on this bad boy. <laughs> Mercy me, that colossal is incredible. And yet there's something rather odd about it. Let's just keep our eyes peeled. Don't be careless. Okay. Wait, not that. Battle. That's Magnus Von Grapple. It's a giant robot built by the x -Nauts. Lord Crump drives it. Max HP 30, attack 2, defense 1. Its most effective attack is one that takes advantage of its size, a smothering stomp. It can also shoot out its fists, which do these super gnarly rocket punches. Its fists have a max XP of 2 and attack of 4, defense of 0. Its fists are super foul, so it's best to knock the mat down fast. The thing about this robot is I can't tell if it looks cool or really, really stupid. And we're not even going to discuss the color. Wait, so we can't target... Hold on. Okay, I mean... Here it comes, suckers! Magnus Von Punish! Ha! Got it. Um, I'm guessing Poops is probably better for this. Put Mario in the front line. Oh, wait a minute. We got this. May as well. Ooh, that was... That was not cool. Should be decent enough. Wait, that didn't do any. That didn't do much. Yeah, no, we're going for the power smash. Oh, wow. Oh, double stylish. I didn't know you could do that. Oh, it ain't yet. This is so awesome. Check out what else this guy can do. You're going to love it. This might not work out too well for you! Uh oh. Okay, we need to take out the arms. This is what she was talking about. See, this is why I have this badge, because now I can swap partners and still attack. Nice. Ah. Oh. 
Okay, uh... Swap back the coops. Oh. Ooh, nice. <laughs> Holy crap. So you can keep chaining it. Okay, well now I know. I can fill up my power bar much quicker that way. Okay, back to Goom. Actually, no, yeah, it should be fine. Good, can't last. Oh, I got a jackpot again. Oh, my, already? Okay. If it wasn't for this badge, this would be much, much more rough. But I, I knew that badge as soon as I saw it. Needed to get it going ASAP. Hey, I got the stylish jump. I don't know how I did it, but I got it. Finish this off. Uh oh. Do it. God, I can't get that last one. <laughs> Assuming that's the last one. It's alright, like, this should be enough. <laughs> this could be the end! I had a game over because I was watching a cutscene. But, blah, uh, no, Magnus wouldn't grapple. How could we lose? I'll remember this, losers. Lord Crump summons us. Retreat, retreat. You pulled that off, Mario. I can't believe we did it. Wow. They're gone. This place can go back to being the peaceful place I remember. According to legend, you can have the emerald star, the crystal star that resided in this tree. I don't think my old person voice was the same. You get it. 
The star power is now three, and Mario learned the special move Clock Out. And so, after pummeling Lord Crump, Mario obtained the second crystal star. With the x knots gone, peace once again prevailed throughout the Great Tree. The Boggly Woods echoed with the puny Songs of Joy. But this may not be our last hero here. The last our hero hears from the vile x knots They will surely continue to stand in Mario's way and try to put a stop to his efforts. I guess we gotta catch up with the story. <laughs> what? Say that again? You can't get in touch with Lord Crump. <laughs> you are correct, sir. We are investigating now. We should hear any time. <laughs> sir Gratis, please allow me to enter. <laughs> what is it? I have a report, sir. The Crystal Star in the Boggly Woods has apparently been taken by Mario. <laughs> what? You must be joking! What about Lord Crump and the Three Shadows? Uh, I'm sorry, sir. Unfortunately, Mario laid a beating on all of them. Hmm. <laughs> Disturbing. Perhaps this Mario character is not the fool I took him for. Speak up, x naught What is the status of the other Crystal Stars? I apologize, sir. Uh, we are still searching for the other Crystal Stars. Unsuccessfully, sir. <laughs> We knew the crystals. There were crystal stars in Hooktail Castle and Bogley Woods, yet Mario claimed them first. The one we seized came from Rogueport. That means there are four crystal stars left out there. And we will have them. Keep looking. Do not let Mario beat us to the punch. Yes, sir. As I suspected, there's no reason to doubt that Mario has that map. He must. Listen up, you. I want you to keep a close watch on what Mario does from now on. Absolutely, sir. <laughs> Mario, I loathe you. Oh, Mario, did you even read the mail I sent you, I wonder? I wonder so many things. I wonder how everyone is doing at the castle. Will I ever, will I never dance at the mushroom ball again? What will become of me? Hold on. <laughs> Take a shower. She says that, and then the joke is she visually changes and then changes back. I don't know why. Like, that's got to be a reference to something. I'm not sure what. Oh, is this text doing again? All right, let's just get through this. It's just this quick scene, and then chapter's done. Hello, Princess Peach. I am glad you came. That mail I sent to Mario, did it reach him alright? Yes, I can confirm that Mario received the mail. Is that so? Well, good. So, what do you want from me today? Is there more you want to know of love? You expressed regret earlier that you would not be able to dance at a ball, correct? Were you eavesdropping? I am sorry, Princess Peach. I have been ordered to keep surveillance on you. But it is odd. When you said that, I had an impulse to dance with you as well. How my CPU would produce this impulse is inexplicable. I must find what caused it. Find out what caused it? There's no reason behind such a feeling, Tech. Wanting to do something together? It's part of love. I know it. But then again, you are, well, a computer. Princess Peach, please dance with me. Wait, wait just a minute. What am I supposed to do? You say you want to dance, it's just so bizarre. 
I mean, how in the world can I dance with you? You have no arms or feet or moves. Would this be an acceptable dance substitute? What? Oh my goodness, is that me? Did you create that? Oh, all right, I guess. I must say, though, it's going to feel weird dancing with myself. Wait for the bu- Oh, don't do this to me right now. <laughs> Not now. Rhythm games, no. You know what the worst part about this is? It's really, really messing with my mind because of Yakuza. And I got used to the Xbox button colors, and now I have to unlearn that. I'm convinced that Nintendo's next console is going to have buttons in this color. Why else would they do this? Thank you, Princess Peach. That was very fun. Just a moment. Fun. Is this impulse? I feel the concept known as fun. Peck, are you okay? To thank you for dancing, please make use of my communicator. Use the keyboard to send whatever message you want. I'm finished, Tech. Could you send it? The message has been sent. Please go back to your room. I want to analyze the data from this dance immediately. The data that I thought was fun. You're a weird computer. No, you are mistaken. I am the world's best and only perfect computer. Good night, Princess Peach. Oh, ah, right, we gotta. I forgot about you. All right. Oh, I'm pretty sure it's just up ahead here. Right as usual, Lord Bowser. We just got word that Princess Peach was spotted in the town up ahead. Ah, oh, good, very good, yes. Then I'm off. Those fools don't know what's coming. <laughs> my lord, you're so super. <laughs> Ready to roll. What is this? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this is great. <laughs> so dumb, but I love it. Okay. Oh, hey, welcome to Pedalberg and... Eek! Hi, everyone, hide! <laughs> what a wuss! Yeah, hide, you chickens! I have no need for any of you! What I do need, though, is Princess Peach. Now, where is she? Tell me this instant! Lord Bowser, over there! Oh no. Bingo! Princess Peach! Man, that was easy! I found you, my princess. I, Bowser, the mighty King Cooper, Cooper King, offer my greeting. Now, now, none of that silent treatment. You're coming to the castle with me. <laughs> Clearly, she's so overcome with joy that she's been left speechless. The mind of a maiden is, well, rather complicated. <laughs> 
<laughs> I see. I see. How refined. How elegant. Awesome. I could go for the strong, silent type. There are too many backseat bosses talking my ears off as it is. No. My, my life's treasure. I'd rather die than give up my life-size peach poster. <laughs> okay. Po poster? Oh my goodness me. Didn't see that coming. G great. Just great. Now I look like the huge mighty king of guys who talk to posters. Okay. And now we can finish chapter. Ah, thank you, Mario, for everything you've done. We can go back to our peaceful way of life now. You know... So, you know, son, now that we get right down to it, I'm kind of sad to see you go. I do love pontificating, so come on by whenever you want to sit and chat a while. Yes, please come back. Oh, wait, yes, please come back and visit. We'll watch for you. Jeez. We'll work together from now on to prevent anything like that from happening again. Thanks for showing us how to stick together, Mario. Good luck with the Crystal Stars. We'll come back and see you again, I'm pretty sure. But for now, I gotta go. See you, Mario. Where is, where is the, uh, the save box? I think it's somewhere here. Hold on. Save box, where are you? It's somewhere nearby. <laughs> God damn it. Dear Mario, I'm sure you're very concerned about me, but please know I'm fine. I'm actually more worried about you. The fiends who kidnapped me are searching desperately for the crystal stars. I'll try to learn what I can about them. I'll email again to if I uncover anything, okay? You must know I miss you. Lately, I've dreamt about our days back in the castle. I hope we'll spend carefree days there again soon. Princess Peach. Pretty nice, eh, Mario? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Save point. Ignore it, ignore it. Ah! <laughs> I can run. <laughs> I can run. No, but I wasn't trying to jump on it. There we go. Alright, that's the end of the chapter. I am leaving it here. Uh, yeah. Hope you enjoyed today's session of Paper Mario. We'll continue this tomorrow at some point, so... If you're watching this later on YouTube as well, thanks for watching as well. If you do want to support the channel, you can do things like click the like button, subscribe, or you can watch me play other things in the meantime if you want to click any of those videos that pop up. That stuff does help out a lot, so thanks to those that do that. Appreciate you checking out the other content. But yeah, we'll see you next time.